An 11-year-old girl was stabbed along with her 34-year-old mother by a white male, who still remains unnamed. The mainstream media is blurring his face out. We wonder why they are trying to protect this attacker's identity, when he is clearly not a minor. Whoever commits disgraceful attacks like this should be named and shamed publicly and punished severely to put an end to these violent attacks that are taking place. A Muslim man named Abdullah saw this happening and was the first person to risk his life to save the victims. He grabbed the attacker, held him down, and disarmed him, saving the lives of the victims. These are the actions of a Muslim that the mainstream media will fail to report. Not a single media company will mention his religion, because as we all know, they only mention the religion when a Muslim does something bad. Yeah, so I saw that he, he was stabbing a kid. I jumped on him, pulled the hand in which he was not hanging a knife, and I just put him down on the floor and just hold him and kick the knife away from him. And then a couple of more people joined as well and we just hold him until the police came. Uh, it took like maybe three to four minutes, police arrived, and then they just took him into the custody. Meanwhile, the uneducated followers of Robinson were out protesting because they want people like Abdullah, the hero of this story, out of the country. An Asian Muslim man who risked his life to save a young child and her mother. It should be known that this is what Islam teaches all Muslims to do. To be heroes who save the innocent. Allah tells us in the Quran that whoever saves a life, it will be as if they saved all of humanity. If it were a Muslim who committed this disgraceful attack, you would see very different headlines from the media mentioning his race and religion as the first thing. Because their propaganda is the very fuel that incites hatred and division of communities. When a white man does this, there is absolutely no emphasis on his race. But if it were someone from another country, you would see the bias headlines all over the media. And religion is only mentioned when a Muslim commits a crime. Otherwise, this is not important for the media to mention. The media and the followers of Robinson are just waiting for one Muslim to slip up, or for one sick, misguided individual to do something bad so they can launch an attack against the entire Muslim community because they paint us all with the same brush. But we do not hold all white people responsible for the crimes of this man. Because God has given us the brains and understanding to know that he is a minority, and the majority are nothing like him. Let this be a lesson to those who don't have the ability to understand, that evil comes in all colors and shapes. We should all be united against the evil actions of these misguided people, and our focus should never be on the color of their skin or their religion. The actions of a small handful of people will never represent the majority. Most people just want to live their lives in peace.